What is up, YouTube? Welcome to NBA 2K16 My Career Mode Part 6. Alright, we're on the third game. 3 out of 4. Check 3, get, get 0 question mark. Uh, uh, okay, okay. It's like NBA uh, Galaxy and all that. 3 gay play for two boy strong Michigan team look, looking to play for Kyle. And we just said he could see going from the 10 to late first round in upcoming NBA draft. Oh, okay, I know what's going on. Alright. I haven't seen any of the cutscenes though. I only watched the gameplay. Oh, we're at home right now. <sighs> Thanks for joining us in a low college basketball fans. We've got a great night ahead and a couple of outstanding teams going in. the ball is have the pleasure to watch. Kevin Harlan here along with Clark Kellogg and Greg Anthony. We'll see the Louisville Cardinals and the Michigan Lynch. Wolverines. And, and guys, there, there's Bruh. just nothing quite like a packed house for a college hoop game. You hear the students say action rocking and the band playing this is pure basketball Greg there's a unique energy and vibrancy with college basketball that is unique I mean when you get two high profile teams meeting up with future stars making a name for themselves I think it just adds to the excitement now let's take a look at Louisville's opening lineup there we go we've got Rozier Harrell is out there with White then there's Sanders and it's Mac in at the five spot you know, so often we can forget that these players are student athletes. I mean, Freak does not have that problem. He's an amazing student off the floor and is very dedicated in the classroom. And how about Freak with a 4.0 GPA, an honor student in high school, and has carried that same work ethic to college as well as he prepares for his games. He Damn. truly embodies what it means. Okay, they can make three all the time, but I can't. I can only like make three once. Such a clear look at the basket from three point range. And the shot is good. Come Defensively, they went for the jump by the way. They start a trend because they just handed him two points. Here's Rozier. Pass to Sanders. Soft Damn touch it. off the glass. Pretty, pretty passing. Timely recognition as to where the open man was. A drive by Bosch. Well, guys, Powell. for Louisville in the last decade or so, it's been a bit of a renaissance in basketball. A title in 2013 gives them three there total we go. now. One of the premier programs in the country for sure. Both free throws good from Bosch. There's not a lot you can say that hasn't been said before about his skill at the charity strike. The feed to Sanders. This is it to Harold. To Sanders. Get out of me. Beautiful dish, and the layup goes down. Guys back and forth this first half. Well, five lead changes early on, guys, as we grapple back and forth. <laughs> and this could continue to go back and forth the entire way. Bosch gets the step. Nice. Down with a nice jam. Clearly. I see that replay. Nice. He's one Why of the best sure you there that. is in the business when it comes to making that lead pass. Sanders passes to Rogier. He dishes it to White. Foul call that time on the way up. Yeah, they made two chances at the free throw line here. Louisville shooting their first free throws tonight. The first trip to the strike in this one. So Michigan ends up going with the new group. A big group. All right. Up by four. How? Louisville leading by four on the court for Louisville. We've got Sanders. Rozier is out there with Harold, and it's Mack in at the five, roaming the paint. Now here's Sanders off the screen, and they will get the basket and here, folks, no as they rule goaltender. Take up. up. He almost got to that shot in time, but not quite. You can't touch the ball once it's on the way down. Here's Bosch. Shot there we go. I just Bosch ran through it. <laughs> And you see a lot of players who are very talented play with a me-first approach. That is not the case with Freak. He doesn't try and attract 
any unnecessary attention and just focuses on playing his game. Yeah, I like that about him, Greg. I mean, in a day and age where most guys are self-centered and it's all about me, it's refreshing for a player like Freak who doesn't Damn invite it. that kind of noise. The hell? I mean, that's as impressive as his skill set. And that's another assist for a team that is putting on a clinic on how to share the ball. And I love the mentality that they've had. If a shot isn't there, they're not there you go. They're moving it side to side until they finally get the one they want. The Cardinals leading by five. Here's Rogier. Pass to Hughes. 119 left here in the first half. No luck. Right here. That defense yeah. went from four to no defense at all. And when he's open like that, you don't see him miss those looks oh. very often. Yeah. And honestly, not real happy with the shot selection on that one. Yeah, clearly a brain fade there. He's got to be a little smarter in his choice making. Here's Hughes. Here's Matt and the rejection by Smith. Left side Jones. Good. And it's nice. Fun talking about. He's got three assists now in this one. Well, well, he knew how many inches he had over the guy. I mean, let's face it. Good decision to just rise up and take the jump shot. Matt, no luck. We've got a nine second difference between the shot clock and the game clock. The pass to Flash. Michigan moving it around. That doesn't go either ah. for Flash. And if they're smart, they can hold it for the last shot. To me, that's got to be the target. Make sure you manage the clock effectively so you do get the last shot. And a wide open look for Sanders. And he's good on the three ball. Sanders has got seven. Michigan trails by six. Flash passes to Bosch. Shoots. Bosch what? With another miss. Major defensive laps right there. I mean, he's not a player you can leave open for a jump shot. You've got to stay attached to him. They're lucky he couldn't punish them for it. And we finish. Hello and welcome back. This is College Basketball on 2K Sports. And if you're just tuning in, this is Kevin Harlan along with Greg Anthony and Clark Kellogg as we get set for the second half. And guys, without a doubt, it's been a rough go so far here for Freak and his team. They just can't find anything to capitalize on consistently thus far. And Greg, I'm anticipating plenty of adjustments from the coach. But I tell you what, when it comes down to what happens in the second half, it's about the players executing. A few quick baskets right Don't out of the Don't let him score. You spoke he has the rebound. On the court for Michigan. Bosch in a two guard. Smith is out there with Ellis. Then it's Jones. Then it's Flash in at the point. No good from Bosch. No good I hate, there, I hate Kevin, this but overall, thing. They're getting slightly out rebound. And that's a good place to start if you're going to try to find your way back into this game. Get to work on the glass. Now here's White following the miss by Freak. Back to White. A three ball. But they'll get another chance. Here's Harold, and the lead now. Jesus double digits Christ. That bucket. And now it's a 10-point Cardinal lead. Guys, he's having a ball out there. I mean, we knew going in that he'd have an advantage on the glass, but I didn't think he could be this dominant. No defense at all. Come on. And the Cardinals will go for a different look here. Thomas checked in for me. Michigan with the ball. One thing with Freak that we know is he makes sure he gets his shots up no matter what. One way or another, he's going to get his workout in, and that's why so many are. Why am I late in the left quarter of the game? Is that he has a twin sister who actually taught him how to play ball. She helped him develop his game and become the player he is today. Pretty nice to have a sibling willing to help you develop your skill set on the court. On the court for Louisville, we've got early. And one. And it's center walking down the middle. Yeah, beautiful play on the interior. They're just using the height advantage. To... Here, let's see that here. Oh, it's not that. When they really.
Lee needed that basket. Louisville leading by three. Passes it to Rogier. Back to Sanders. Pass to Rogier. Again, the Cardinals score. Jeez, he is not going to have block. On the interior. Yeah, you can't say that with enough emphasis. I mean, the defenders are just not being aggressive enough down low. You got to play with some physicality in the paint. Now, here's Bosch. No I can't Bosch. score. That's some more rugged I need to get up. Oh, they have a decent edge in rebounds thus far. And all that hard work on the boards needs to continue because that Dude, no key things at all. Where God. Every opportunity and Getting results too. Yeah, that's that a winning pissing me off. As far as I'm concerned, they've been the aggressors and far more assertive on the offensive end. What? Well, he won't miss many of those. Fucking glitchy ass the game. Not in the best of positions yet. That drops. I'm going with this game. Nine point cardinal lead. That's the third bucket. This is probably the last uh, part I'm doing for a while. Those lanes Fucking air game. Much more effective. You just cannot allow the offense to have that quality of the look. Each and every possession. He can you cry. Can see the defenders afraid to kind of get in his way a lot of times when he's on his way to the basket. But on that one, they were there. Matt, no luck. And with Freak, he takes a lot of pride in where he hails from. Didn't go up with a silver spoon in his hand by any means. Yes. There we go. And Greg, you can see it in this game. I mean, we're all a product of where we've been, our environment, our experiences. And with Freak, he doesn't take anything for granted. Some of the very best players of all time have come from the projects like Freak. And he takes pride in playing for Harlem when he's on the court. And here's Sanders following the three-pointer by Freak. It's stolen by Jones. Time definitely not on their side. They need a very quick bucket, a real quick one. And too long what? on the shot. Bruh, I was open and they didn't even freaking throw it to me. 50 seconds left Are you kidding me? We're already down and you're not even doing anything. I'm going to get back here. Clark, no room for air here. Kevin got to be perfect from here on out. You're exactly right. Bosch can't hit wow. Freaking interior D to force the miss. His defensive ability is a big factor. I mean, thank no you. What I'm talking about. On both ends there, the steal and the quick push on the break. Great, you fouled him. Good job. And it's best. Boom, 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 bang. And they go to the intentional foul. Jeez. So it's Louisville now. They've led by as much All as right. 10. And he commits the intentional foul. Yeah, that's right. No other option but to foul and hope for some misses. Yeah, they have to extend the game. I mean, plain and simple. Use every second you can on the clock here. So he goes two for two at the line, and it's a yeah, we lost. Good work at the line to stretch that lead out a little bit. We've got 22 seconds left in this one. Give me the ball. What are you doing? Flash passes to Bosch. Jesus. Oh, and a fast break for Louisville. He could have passed before I could win. And now we've got the intentional foul. Got go. Otherwise, we're losing because they go keep going for the fucking fouls. He hits the first one, and that makes it a six. Yeah, yeah, we fucking lost. Jesus Christ. Sorry, but that, that's just fucking retarded now. It doesn't really matter, so. I'll go on 18. They may not put me on picking. Alright, uh, thanks for watching. Sorry if, if I was yelling too loud. Sorry I was getting picked, but yeah. Alright, like, subscribe, comment. My friend's not gonna be in this video, so enjoy.